How's it going guys? It's white bread. I'd recommend you guys eating some breakfast too. Maybe pause the video right now. It's it could be the morning for you guys. It could be the afternoon. It could be nine time. You know, grab yourself a snack and uh yeah. Have you guys ever had like um a clown at a birthday party? I don't know if I have, but today we're gonna be watching a Jubilee video. Of, do all clowns think the same? If you walk up to a child, they, you can't change your facial expression now, and you walk up to you're like, Hello, Clarice. Holy shit. Like, ah! What the hell, dude? Okay, that's a beautiful start to the video. Imagine that clown giving a voice to a children's birthday party. Jeez, man. Oh yeah, everyone strongly agrees. Yeah, you better. You freaking better, dude. You better strongly agree, dude. You guys are freaking scary. Have you not seen the movie It? Holy cow. The old It movie? That shit was scary. Clown and like what the societal impact that the clown had is they are the ones that are supposed to poke holes in whoever says they have authority. A lot of people have never met a clown that like is really good at doing makeup or has put a lot of thought into creating their character. Especially if you run into a clown who doesn't know what they're doing. I've seen white face clowns that don't own Why are they, okay, it. my question is why are these guys wearing clown outfits? This girl right here isn't wearing a clown outfit. She's pretty she she's normal. Unless she's just not a clown, but I'm pretty sure it's only clowns that are on the, in this video. And they put this be like jack o' lantern smile. Can't change your facial expression now. And you walk up to you're like, Hello, Clarice. And they're like, Ah! You've scared, <laughs> now scarred this child for life. Yeah, dude. Like, that's, 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 that's literal real life it movie but nightmares right there. I think that if you are, are pushing it and trying to force somebody to be into it. Mm. it Look at this lady. She's not trying that hard with the clown outfit. She got the little duckies on, the little tiny red nose. This is gonna be very disturbing to watch for me. I don't know why. I just, I think it is. It's just a recipe for disaster. We also have problems with people who like to try to freak out their friends. I'll be at a parade and they're like, oh, you should come and say hi to my friend. He loves clown. No, no. No. Oh my goodness. Hold on, guys. I gotta put my bowl away. You know what, you guys? I feel like somewhat clowns are the reason why I will never, ever go to places like haunted houses or anything, right? Like, the, I'm not talking about, like, the real haunted houses. I'm talking about, like, the, the, the fake ones. Like, obviously, I'm not gonna go to an actual haunted house. I'm gonna fucking die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. <laughs> There's this thing in my area called the Halloween haunt. I wouldn't even go there. Right, I, 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 me personally, I wouldn't even want to go there. My friends are like, oh, why don't you want to go there? <laughs> Andrew, Andrew, why, Andrew, why do you want to go there? Because I'm scared. Can I not be scared? You know what? You know what though, man? The funny thing about this, the funny thing about that is, right? I'm able to watch scary movies so normally. Like scary movies don't scare me. They, they don't scare me. But when I go to an actual like event or festival, or even if I play freaking video games, one of I tried playing uh this one game called blood wash no nah. <laughs> i'm i'm good i'm good dude i'm i'm okay i it's just i think it's just the interaction feature of it you know <laughs> what the fuck <laughs> what kind what kind of question is that yeah i disagree too man see it's not dude they're all wearing clown costumes except for this girl what the heck dude is she an imposter i think she's an imposter what's up with her what the heck is up with this lady? She's got this like weird sort of makeup thing going on, right? And then she's wearing like some weird clothes. And then she's got like some weird socks going on. Yes, everyone else is the weird one. They think we're the weird ones, but it's somebody else's. And I can speak to this because while I was doing a news interview for Ringling Brothers, the reporter kept hitting on me. It's really? What the morning. hell? I look like this. What is happening? I had some guy on Facebook who just started Bro. with, oh, so you do this for real? And I'm like, yeah. And he's like, you know what I'd really like? He said, I want you to come over and I want you to tie me to the bed with the balloons. And then I want you to completely cover me in clown white. And then I want you to make me your bitch. Yeah, that, no, that's not happening. I <laughs> Dude, is that oh no did it actually happen did it oh. i think if we had more people here there might be some people over there because there are many different sub versions of clowns and oh there's yeah clown yeah poor yeah and there like uh <laughs> like harley quinn <laughs> i think a lot a lot a lot of people would want to have fun with harley quinn <laughs> clowns hate children Mmm. 
Oh, was that a fake out? <laughs> that was, was that a, a joke? Out. They will tell you if you're funny. They will tell you if they don't like you. They will tell you if they don't like the way that you look. I think people shouldn't assume. Clown. Dude, what the heck is up with her? She is not a clown. She is not a clown. She's a freaking psychopathic serial killer. What the heck is she wearing? Look at all that. Look at all that. What the f Holy cow, dude, I don't even want to look at that, man. That is disturbing. That is disturbing to see. You are not a clown. You are not a clown. You should be working at a ha uh, at a haunted house, man. You should be the one that scares me, not, you know, has fun with me. Like children. Children are people, and there's a lot of people that suck. Um, and so some kids suck. But they are our best audience. <laughs> they are the, yeah. To be funny, you have to be really perceptive. You have to have an opinion. You have to be emotionally intelligent. You have to be tapped. You know what though? You know what though? That question. Room, like what works, what doesn't. Yeah. Well, you know what though? That question in the first place. Clowns are uneducated. What if he's? What if the person is like the smartest dude in the world, and 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 his side job is is being a clown? That's that's some weird. That'll be a dope ass anime. Not gonna lie. <laughs> Something to be said for a lifetime of experience. Um, the clowns that I learned from who were doing this for 30 plus years and they have a lot of knowledge. If they make it look easy, then they're doing the I job I like right. this guy's yeah. accent. That dude's ask, accent is awesome. Not because of the work that I've done or my peers that I personally worked with have done, but because of other people. What they have done or what they do. And then people point at that and they say, you do that? And you're like, that is not, <laughs> that's not what I do. <laughs> I've been accused of being a child murderer. I've been oh, accused, damn. Of, accused of being a child rapist. So I'm like, some, sometimes I just don't want to talk about it. I just don't need that accusation. Yeah. Okay, well then, damn, that, that took a turn. The lady was saying one thing. Dude said a completely different other thing. <laughs> being a clown, I guess, you know, clowns have a bad rep because of how they've been perceived in, you know, pop culture. Yeah, I just, I feel bad. I feel bad because, you know, what if people want to just be a clown as a career, right? They don't want to be called, oh, rapist, sex offender, oh, murderer, right? I'm not always happy about clowning. Three, two, Shoot, one. if they say agree. Fuck. So I'm at this thing, Dude. my father's just been put into memory care. He's like level six of Alzheimer's and that was terrible. And then I lost my job and all these awful things are happening to me. But I had to be there to say, oh, you want a balloon? Sure. What kind of balloon do you Dude, want? Dude, that guy's accents changed from like, oh, good evening, sir, to hey, yo, what's up, dog? Today, oh, I can do that. Squeak, 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 squeak. And I had to be on. Right. But at the same time, my inside, my head was like, oh, hell with this noise. There's a such thing. Part of entertainment is you have to drown out whatever you're thinking and, and, and put on the show, right? You know, I can agree with that. I can agree with that from, you know, a YouTuber talking to a clown because a clown is the same as a YouTuber in, ter in terms of entertainment, right? And it, it, we're both entertainers. You know, toxic positivity, but at times where I felt sadness putting on the makeup and going to see folks, kids, brightening their day for sure you know, improve mm -hmm. my mood. Part of my gig is a therapeutic medical clown. I'm working in the hospital and I'm witnessing and seeing some really sad stuff and naturally it hits you at your core uh, and clown in a hospital dude emotionally i too work in pediatric hospitals and it's sometimes very very heavy and your job is to be hu fun at, at the core of it is to be a human is to connect being a clown you got to fight reality to to give a bit of fantasy in order for children to have their fun right you got to let go of whatever the hell you're thinking and just put on the show especially at a hospital just think Thinking about a child dying is, is very heartbreaking. You'd want to make sure you're as entertaining as, as, as much as you can be before the kid passes. Man, these, those people, those people are, they're weird in their like own little clown ways, but honestly, I kind of, I kind of dig it, not gonna lie. I like the mind, the minds that, that these clowns have. Their main mission is to entertain. Uh, oh, God of mighty thunder. And that right there, folks, is how we end off the video. If you guys enjoyed the video, please make sure to like and subscribe. Helps me out a lot. Uh, more, more to come on the way. Um, hope you guys are doing great. I know I am. As always, peace. Adios.